It's too cold to change out here. Little spill. Get it cleaned up real quick. All good. <laughs> it's all right, man. Ay, bendito. Mijo, qué guapo. <laughs> Gracias, mami. I invited a guest tonight. Can you get the apartment ready? Oh, um, maybe put on some music, set the mood? Ah, oh, Naja. Really? Your campaign manager on Christmas Eve? Well, tomorrow's rally isn't going to plan itself. Thanks for getting the apartment ready, mijo. Hello? <laughs> Yo pensé que ya habíamos llenado esos formularios. No. Ay, esto nunca termina. Hmm. No records. Hey, mom, where's dad's vinyl? Um, should be in my room. Thanks. Sí, claro. Guess mom's not done unpacking either. That wallpaper just screams, abuela. And what's that? Huh. Must have gotten mixed up in the move. One of dad's old case files. Who's the prowler? I wonder if dad ever caught the guy. Haven't looked through these since before City Hall. I think this was Uncle Aaron's. Dad never played it, but he also never got rid of it. Bleached borax, mm -hmm. borax with bleach, boraxed bleach. Hey man, you guys have any regular bleach bleach? You sure bleach is a good idea? Yeah, for sure. Why? No reason. What's the pick, DJ? The greatest record ever. Haven't heard that one in a while. It was Uncle Aaron's. Oh, well, it's a great record. Seguro que sí. Glad Dad's tree survived the move. Me too. He loved that little guy. Ain't no Christmas like a Brooklyn Christmas. I miss hearing him say that. That doorbell's been broken for years. Miles, could you get that? Of course. How are your parents, Ganky? Finn? Hey. Fixed your doorbell. <laughs> it's so good to see you. How are you? It's been like... Months. A lot's changed. Yeah. It really has. Is that our guest of honor? Come on in, you two. Dinner's almost ready. Finn, I'm so glad you could make it. Thanks for inviting me, Miss Morales. <laughs> we missed you. Well, this one especially. <laughs> uh, hi. Finn, this is Genki. My friend from Brooklyn Visions Academy. Genki, this is Finn. My best friend. <laughs> my other best friend. <laughs> oh, yeah. You guys won the middle school science fair at County, right? You made a... a... Energy, Energy converter? converter? 
Jinx! <laughs> oh. <sighs> the wiring in this building is such a mess. I'll check the circuit breaker. Gracias. So, Christmas by candlelight? I promise I didn't break it when I fixed your doorbell. I hadn't considered that. No good. Breaker doesn't have power. Looks like the whole block's out. Let me check if I can see anything from the fire escape. Okay, honey. But be safe. Definitely can't get to the transformer from here. Unless you're super sticky. Out. People on the roof. Can't go up there. Yeah, got the whole block. Really hope no one can see me up here. <sighs> Don't look out the window. Don't look out the window. Think Miles is having any luck outside? I hope so. Hot plates are only going to get us so far in salvaging this dinner. Bioelectricity can take down Rhino. But can it save Christmas dinner? Come on. It worked. Oh, man, those lights are bright. Did not think this through. Gotta get back inside ASAP. Keep them distracted, Genki. Come on, Genki. Is Miles still outside? Actually, oh. uh, what about a photo? <laughs> Right now? Yeah, you know, precious moments. You gotta capture them. Shouldn't we wait for Miles? No, he hates photos. <laughs> All right, everyone squeeze in. Ready? Great photo, great photo. Oh, hey, Miles. Uh, who's ready to eat? You guys sit down. I got this. Mm, smells good. Mm. Finn, tell us everything you've been up to. You still in robotics club? I had to quit, but I've been studying biotech on my own. Nerd. Oh, says the guy who has to wear an ascot to school. <laughs> hey, only on Tuesdays. <laughs> Does your brother Rick still work for Roxon? I don't know how anyone could work there after seeing your last campaign ad. You went for Simon Krieger's jugular. <laughs> that reminds me. Genki, you have a certain flair for social media. Could you spread the word about tomorrow's rally? Yeah, we'll be trending by midnight. Sometimes it feels like Simon Krieger's my real opponent. Roxon has so much influence here, but they don't answer to anyone except their shareholders. Harlem needs someone to fight for the community. That's mom's campaign speech voice, in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, you want to proofread these before I post them? Yes! Do not hit send! <laughs> so, what's going on with you? What do you mean? You seem... I don't know. Distracted. Want to talk about it? Not tonight. It's Christmas. Hey, how are you handling the move from Brooklyn? I mean, it's fine. Ugh. You hate it. No. Nah. That's your, I hate it, but I'm too nice to say it voice. No, it's, I don't know anybody here, and I'm always having to ask for directions. You need to find a good restaurant, a barber shop, somewhere you can shoot hoops. You'll settle in. What if we hang out tomorrow? Just the two of us. You're not too busy? It's winter break. 
I can put off homework for at least another week. Okay, I'll text you. It's a date. I, I mean, n not a date, uh, you know, a, a friend date. Still as smooth as the last time I saw you. <laughs> <laughs>